My name is Sally. Welcome to Storytime. Today I have a hippity hoppity bunny story time to share with you. I wanted you guys to meet my special bunny friend, Flopsy. Say hi, Flopsy. Flopsy doesn't make very much noise because she's a bunny, so she's nice and quiet. But Flopsy was whispering to me earlier that she has a favorite bunny poem and she asked me to share it with you all today. Bunnies are brown, bunnies are white, bunnies are always a springtime delight. Bunnies are cuddly, bunnies large as well as small, but I like the chocolate ones, the sweetest of all. Flopsy doesn't like chocolate, Flopsy loves carrots. What a silly bunny. You all say bye to Flopsy for now so that we can tell another bunny story. Flopsy's gonna go watch story time while we tell the story of the runaway bunny. Bye Flopsy. This story is called The Runaway Bunny by Margaret Wise Brown. Once there was a bunny who wanted to run away. If you run away, said his mother, I will run after you, for you are my little bunny. If you run after me, said little bunny, then I will become a fish in a trout stream and I will swim away from you. If you become a fish in a trout stream, I will become a fisherman and I will fish for you. Well, if you become a fisherman, says little bunny, I will be a rock up on a mountain high, high above you. If you become a rock on the mountain high above me, said his mother, I will be a mountain climber and I will climb to where you are. You take a look and see the rock that looks like Bunny and his mom, the mountain climber, climbing to where he is. If you become a mountain climber, said little Bunny, I will be a crocus in a hidden garden. Crocus is a flower. If you become a crocus in a hidden garden, said his mother, I will be a gardener and I will find you. Well, if you are a gardener and you find me, said Little Bunny, I will be a bird and I will fly away from you. If you become a bird and fly away from me, said his mother, I will be a tree that you will come home to. If you become a tree, said little bunny, I will become a sailboat and I will sail away from you. If you become a sailboat and sail away from me, said his mother, I will become the wind and I will blow you where I want you to go. You become the wind. You blow me to where you want me to go, said little bunny. I will join a circus and fly away on a flying trapeze. If you go flying on a flying trapeze, said his mother, I will be a tightrope walker and I will walk across the air to you. If you become a tightrope walker and walk across the air, said Little Bunny, I will become a little boy and run into the house. If you become a little boy and run into the house, said the bunny, I will become your mother and cuddle you up tight. I will always find you. There's Little Bunny and his mother curled up in their den at home.
the end. I have one more thing to share with you guys today. And this one is almost like a magic trick. And there's a poem to go with it. See if you can follow along at home. This is a leaf. This is a leaf that you see make too. This is the bud of the flower. Watch it bloom and grow for you. You can try that at home. If you have some scarves or even socks, colorful socks, put them up into a ball, put them in your fist, hold them tight together. And then you say the words, this is a leaf, this is a leaf that you see make too. This is the bud of the flower. Watch it bloom and grow for you. Well done, everyone. Thank you for joining me for story time today. See you next time.